Football shithousery. What is it? And how did we get here? Here's a two minute history explaining everything you need to know about the dark arts of the beautiful game. First, the language. Shithouse, vernacular noun meaning extremely unpleasant place. Here in 2021, the bathroom is an idyllic place of refuge. Browse Instagram, reply to emails, kick back and have some you time. But in 1821, the shithouse was an unlit, uninsulated outbuilding filled with bugs and vermin and the stench of many previous occupants. Shithousery, therefore, is the act of being extremely unpleasant. And in football, there's two main variants. One, create an extremely inhospitable environment. Two, achieve an unfair advantage through extremely unpleasant behavior. Diego Maradona's hand of God took shithousery out of the shadows in the 1986 World Cup. A clear handball, a total disdain for the rules, an utter contempt for the spirit of fair play, and a gleeful rejoicing in sporting deviance. Whew, Maradona was an elite dark arts practitioner on every level. At the other end of the pitch, football hardman Vinny Jones set the bar for defensive shithousery. The gentleman's handshake he offered Paul Gascoigne in 1988 clearly inspired a whole generation of modern shithouse specialists like Pepe Busquets and Sergio Ramos. In the early 90s, German striker Jurgen Klinsmann perfected the dive, faking serious injury with twists, rolls, and groans. Didier Drogba innovated with a neck hold and handshake that suggested the imminent loss of consciousness. And in recent years, Neymar elevated it to a whole new art form with one of the longest sustained dives in history. An eight meter surging vault that comprised 10 whole body twists. And enough pathos to shame Michelangelo himself. Environmental shithousery includes time wasting by players, officials, and ball boys, as well as flares, projectiles, and decapitated animal carcasses hurled onto the pitch by fans. Yes, that actually happened. So in essence then, the dark arts of football either banish you to the shithouse or shit from a great height upon your most cherished hopes and dreams.